few fundamentals. So this next one is a mix of the turn and the lift. So when I'm riding through the rocky section, thinking line for the front, line for the rear, front comes to the rock, obviously you've got to lift up as well and turn at the same time. So I always try and keep the front wheel high on rocks as well because it's keeping the front end out of trouble and front wheel up high, more pressure on the rear tire for grip as well. So it's a really good technique, but it just combine all the key points that we've already done with the turn and the lift. So you come in tall on the bike, up brake covered, flex down, a little bit of brake, and then put a wheelie onto it. So quite often we're using that technique just to take weight off the, the front. You've literally just got to obviously get from there enough to get onto the pipe. And the closer you are and softer the gas, the more control you'll have when the front wheel's on. So you start to turn just a little bit before, pressure down, front wheel along, stays on the height, back wheel stays on the ground, and then roll it off, get control, and then the more advanced progression, front wheel on, flex down again, float the front wheel. Bigger lift, better the technique has to be. 